Hello everybody, welcome to CVA and today we're going to be doing a Fast and Furious Garage Tour. I did tease that I want to do one of these and I think it's the perfect day to drop a video and do one. So let's get into it. So the first thing we're going to do, this is the car from Tokyo Drift. This is Sean's car from Tokyo Drift and it's built off the Mitsubishi. Now to get this car, you have to upgrade it at Benny's. You have to go to Benny's and you have to upgrade this car to this version right here this is the rs so it's, and this is what this car is right here and you can see the rs on the steering wheel if you actually look you can see it. if you look right there you can see that all right so we're going to go over here to the other sultan see if you look on the back there's a sultan rs emblem right there and if you look over here it's the same thing so this is the sultan rs we're going to go back to this sultan right here now this is a Sultan RS this is a yellow one but you have to upgrade this at Benny's I believe you have to upgrade this one yes yes you do because you have like the the exhaust right down here so you have to upgrade this one at Benny's and this is the one that Paul Walker uses to get away from the cops in the Fast and Furious movie and I believe you only see this car one time in the film okay now this right here is the GTR and this is the LOG if you look on the back you see the LOG right there that is what you will see now right here this is the LOG but this is built off the GT the GTR this is what this car is built off of now this car you only see it once this is when Shaw was going after the crew he went after Han and he was going now he went up to Brian he went after he went to Dom now what he did he called Dom and said you don't know me but you're about to get to know me and when he did that there was a bomb that he delivered to their house and he tried to kill them but Dom saved them in time he called Dom first to you know let him know hey I'm gonna kill you and he saved them Dom saved them so you only see this car once and this is the LG only see this car one time in this part is parked at the house Paul Walker and his son was there and his wife was there and the bum blew up it didn't kill them but it blew up and then that's when Dom that's when Dom had to go out he said he was gonna go handle them so he went to go handle it now we're gonna go right here to the red Daytona now this car right here is the Phoenix you have to get the Phoenix in order to build this car now with this car you don't have to do much honestly you really don't have to do much you just have, have to put a uh, high wing out here a high a high spoiler on this car and you're basically done with it but this is the Phoenix now this car you see twice in the movie once he uses it to race Letty and the second time he uses it again to save her when they were running from a tank in the movie on the bridge I remember that scene but he used this car to save her and this car ends up getting destroyed now we're gonna go over here this is Letty's car now this car right here was used when it was chasing Dom in the city now they did catch Dom in the car but Dom had got the car and ran away and Letty chased him into a back alley so yes he did this he he actually did this this was in the movie and this car was in the movie and you only I believe you only see this car one time and after that she doesn't use this car anymore all right so we're gonna go here to the Karen now there's two versions of the Karen if you guys know there's the armor version and this is this is the other one that doesn't have the armor on it so this car right here is based off the Mitsubishi now this car was racing on the ice this car was racing on the ice and i believe you only see this car one time in that scene they were racing they were all on the ice i remember that scene but yes you only see this car one time now we're going to move over here and now this car is from fast and furious tokyo drip this is the car that Sean uses now you see it twice I believe now the first time you see it the car is not pro properly built up but the second time you see it he races with it and he actually wins the race 
and this is from he beats the drift king i believe in this car i believe he used another car to do it but i believe it was this car and this is the rapid gt classic this what this is and i believe you might have to upgrade it at Benny's. I don't think I did, but I believe you might have to. So do not quote me on that, but I don't think you have to with this one. Now, we're gonna go over here. This is the Jester Classic. Now, this is the Frost Ice White. Now, this is Paul Walker's tribute car. This is the car that, that Paul Walker uses when him and Don speak to each other for the last time in the movie. And they go their separate ways. So this is Paul Walker's tribute car. His send-off car if you want to know. If you want to be more specific with it. Now, this car right here is the R900. But this car is built off the RX7 that Han uses. He drives with that car all the time. It's one of his signature cars. Now, this car is destroyed when Shaw goes as a Han in Tokyo Drift. Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift, he goes right after them, he rams this car and he destroys it. And this is when everyone thought that Han was dead, but he's not actually dead, he actually survived. Now, this car right here, you don't have to take the, I believe that you have to take this car to Benny's and upgrade it. I'm not sure, but I believe I did take it to Benny's and upgrade it. So this is what this car is built off of, the RX7. Now, for the last car right here, this is the GTR Supra. Yes, this is the GTR. It's not really the GTR, but it's the LG, but it's based off the GTR. Now, this is the car that Paul Barker was using, was using when they was racing, him and Dom, they were racing on a mountain on a quarry. They didn't really actually race, they were showing off the cars and Dom had his all black Dodge Charger. Paul Walker had his GTR, which is a Supra. This is what he had. And this is a silver one. It was all silver when he raced him. And this is the LG, like this one over here, this is the LG. This is the blue LG and this is the Supra GTR it is built and based off this. So we got two of these in here and we have two Sultan RSs. That's what we have in this in this uh, garage. I'm going to walk around at least one more time so you can get a good look at these cars. And if you want to build them, go for it. I'm gonna look, we're going to walk on this side. We're gonna walk on this side. So if you look at the mirrors, it is black. I am aware of that. I will be working on that sooner or later. I will fix that and I will work on that. Now, we're gonna go over here on this side. We're gonna go over here. Gonna go here. This is Leslie's car. This is Dom's car right here. Paul Walker's Paul Walker car. Paul, Paul Walker car is over here. And that one is too. This is one of his other cars right here. This is a Jota. It's just a classic right here. Okay, so we're gonna walk over here. We're gonna finish this part off right here. So this is all the cars that I have, guys. This is it. This is every single car that we that I built that we built so far. This is every single car that we built, guys. All of it. And I am working on another GT. I am working on another Grand Theft Auto garage tour but it's gonna be another fast and furious and i might try to build another gtr like a lg i don't know but i doubt i will so i might not be working on another gtr i said i would i would work on one but i'm not gonna work on another one because my cars are basically they're basically built off the movie they're basically based off the movie so if they don't have another gtr i won't be building it and I said I would, but I'm not. And I was about to say I was going to build another one. But no, I would not be building another GTR. I would not be doing that. But thank you guys for supporting the videos and stuff anyway. And I super duper appreciate it. So thank you. Thank you very much. And I, I thank you guys for supporting my videos. And hopefully, if you guys like them, we'll make more vid car videos related to Grand Theft Auto and Fast and Furious. So thank you guys for the love and support. 
I love every single one of you guys. I hope you guys have a great and wonderful day. I love you guys. I'll see you later, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.